Now, take a look at these photographs and just see what they all have in common. What a picture, click, what a picture, what a photograph. Poor old soul, love me, what a joke. At home, off in a cloud of smoke, that man. Stamp your feet, banging on the big bass drum. What a picture, what a picture, um, tilly, um, bum, 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 bum. Stick it in your family, Alba. That's right, heaps of well-known people just queuing up to be photographed with one man. He's obviously extremely successful, so he fits into this programme very well. The funny side of success, meet Tony Appleton. <laughs> now, now, you're the guy who's been leaping in and out of here tonight, having your picture taken with people. Why is it that all these famous people queue up to have their photograph taken with you? No, they don't queue up to have their photograph taken with me. I had to queue up to have my photograph taken with them. But how easy is it to get so close to the famous to get your picture taken with them? Well, it's not very easy. Sometimes, I mean, sometimes you just walk in and get the picture. But you do not ask. You go straight in, snap, and then ask afterwards. That is the art of it. That's a bit rude, isn't it? Well, sometimes, yes. <laughs> now, you, you've been snapped with Joan Collins. Yeah, Joan is very American, nice. American, and so is most of the male population <laughs> yeah. of America. Joan, I met uh, Joan at um, a celebrity golf, and she was absolutely superb. And you've also come across some famous male stars in your time as well. There was Michael Caine. Yeah, Michael Caine, um, he was a difficult one, because um, I've met him in London a couple of times and told me to, you know, off. And um, at this uh, <laughs> time, I got him on set at 1.30 in the morning, and he was on a location, and uh, I grabbed him just coming out of his dressing room, and he couldn't refuse me. He's looking a bit surprised there. Have you, you actually got him by the scruff of the neck? He said, I'm oh, not you again. <laughs> Ringo Starr gave you a tough time, didn't he? Yeah, I used to work at Ringo Starr's house, actually, years ago, and um, I met him in Beecham Place and introduced myself, and uh, he was pretty rude, so um, I said, I'm going to get my picture with you, which I did. <laughs> and he just, he just asked for two copies of it I, as won't well. tell you what, <laughs> I won't tell you what he said afterwards. <laughs> now, we have got a unique piece of video of Tony Appleton in action here, trying to get somebody's picture. This was actually uh, Elizabeth Taylor. Take us through this piece of film, because it's, it's fascinating. Right, this is um, at a press conference Elizabeth Taylor was holding for a new play she was launching. Now, you've got some stiff competition there. There's the yeah. world's press gathered. And there's all the buddy guys behind. You'll see them on the side there, and they're really standing with their back. They're not prepared for me. To, Are you uh... disguised as that column? <laughs> yeah. There I go now with the orchid. Blimey! Straight over. In I go through. Got the picture. My photographer took the picture. And then the uh, guards dispose of me straight away. <laughs> You've been walking straight ever since, have you? <laughs> yeah. But you did actually get the picture, didn't you, Elizabeth Taylor? I got Taylor. the picture, yes, got the picture. Oh, yeah. There it is there. Actually got the yeah, snap. Yeah, yeah, got the snap. And yeah. that was just before you went into hospital. Uh, that's right. <laughs> yeah. I mean, who do you really want to get? Who are the ones you're aiming well, for Well, I'm next? definitely going to get, without any question, because I've had one with Margaret Thatcher. I'm going to get Mikhail G uh, Gorbachev, President Reagan, and I want one with Michael Jackson. It's Tony Appleton, thank you for the moment. Stay right where you are. Brilliant. Tony Appleton. <laughs>